what is up guys it's your boy sloppy here welcome back to another video on the channel before i get into the video i just want to shout out koro fn for being the first one to comment on my last video thank you for the support bro thank you for sticking around on the channel so in this video i'm going to be showing you guys how to stop call of duty warzone from actually crashing now it's a big thing a lot of people are facing the crash i did just before i fixed it so in this video is going to be showing you guys the quickest and easiest method of fixing the crash All right, so the first thing that you're going to do is that you're going to go to Battle.net. You're going to go down to Partner Games and you're going to click on Call of Duty MW. Then you're going to go to Options, Game Settings, and then you're going to see Call of Duty MW Additional Command Line Arguments. What you're going to do is click this. You're going to click in the bar and you're going to type dash DRD11. So what this does, it forces the game to run at DirectX 11 instead of DirectX 12 because that seems to be the issue, the game crashing because it's using DirectX 12. All right, so after that, you're going to click finish or done. Then you're going to start the game. Now, once you start the game, you're going to use another program to force the game to run on normal priority. So what the game does itself, it forces itself to run high priority. And when it does that, it crashes after a few minutes if you have a weak cpu or it just crashes a lot so what you're going to do is that you're going to download the program it's called lasso uh process lasso my bad so you're going to download the program it's called process lasso now once you download the program and install it you're going to look for call of duty right here you see modern warfare exe if you go over, you're going to see it says normal priority. That is because I set it to normal priority. So what you're going to do is that you're going to click on it, right click on it, go to priority class, go to always and set to normal priority. Again, what this does is forces the game to run at normal priority and not to crash every minute because it's at I or above. So pretty much that is how you fix the crash in Call of Duty Warzone. If you guys like the video and you find it helpful in any way, shape or form, please leave a like on this video and also comment in the description and let me know if it helped you out. And finally, subscribe to the channel for future content. Thank you and I hope to see you in many more videos.